Hi, I'm Mr. Optimization, and I'm here to teach you how to get your site into the top 10 search results on Google. How to choose your keywords. Ask yourself, what is your website built around? What does your website offer? How do you expect people to find it? Which keywords might they use? From these questions, you come up with the keywords. Most of the time, you will have more than one keyword that has the same meaning, but you don't know which one to choose. In this case, you can look up both words with Word Tracker at www.wordtracker.com. With this, you can see which words are most searched for and use that one. After choosing your keywords, it's time to pick your domain. Only you can decide what that will be. One important rule, your domain must consist of your keywords. This is not an absolute, as some domains may not be related to the keywords at all, but still get ranked in the top 10. But we're talking about a definite top 10 listing, in a short, easy way, and using your keywords in your domain is the best way to do that. Here's an example of everything we've mentioned so far. Let's say I want to sell a tutorial on SEO that focuses on Google, and this tutorial promises to get you into a top 10 listing. Sound familiar? So here are my keywords. Tutorial. SEO, Google, and Top 10. But after going to WordTracker.com, I find that the keyword optimization is searched more often than the word SEO. Based on those statistics, I drop the word SEO from the list and replace it with the word optimization. I then figure people will search for my product in one of the following ways. Google Top 10, Google Top 10 Optimization, Optimization for Google Top 10, Google Top 10 Tutorial, SEO for Google Top 10, and many other possibilities. At the end, I came up with the domain www.googletop10optimization.com, which consists of most of my keywords, which I found to be among the most searched phrases. You should also come up with a domain for your website, which consists of a maximum keywords and the most searched phrases based on your products. What if you bought this tutorial and you already have a domain? Don't worry. You have two options. Option 1. Buy another domain. They usually cost less than $10. Option 2. You keep your current domain, but spend a little more effort and wait a little longer to get your required results. Optimizing for country-based Google Targeting a country-based Google search engine is very simple. Everything we've mentioned or going to mention will remain the same except the domain. To target a country-based Google, you buy a country-based domain name. For example, if you're targeting google.co.uk, then buy a domain that ends with .co.uk and not .com. And if you're targeting google.ca, then buy a domain that ends with .ca and not .com, etc.